Hey guys, Kevin here with eTrailer, and today we're going to be taking a look at the 24 by 84 eTrailer cargo carrier for RV bumpers here on our 2022 East to West Alta Travel Trailer. Typically, your trailer is going to come with a bumper on the back of it, but it's not always going to come with a trailer hitch receiver on the back so that you can easily put on a hitch mounted cargo carrier. In place of that, we have our eTrailer cargo carrier for RV bumpers. It's going to have a couple of brackets that easily slip onto your bumper and bolt into place. One of the things I like most about this is that it's an all steel construction. Typically when you have uh, these cargo carriers, only that support beam that runs across is really the only strong piece and then these bars that run uh, side to side typically are pretty flimsy. So you really don't have a lot of support. I've seen so many cargo carriers where people have put heavy coolers or a generator or something like that and it's kind of started to bend those bars. With this, you're not gonna have to worry about it. These are nice sturdy steel construction with a powder coat on it so it's going to resist rust and it's not going to start drooping down or bending or taking any damage. So I'm going to give you a couple of measurements right now. So the outside of our basket itself is about 25 and a half inches. On the inside it's going to be 24 inches and then our length on the inside is going to be 84 with an outside length of 85 and a half. Now this is going to stick past your bumper roughly 26 inches. So you're going to have to accommodate for that as well whenever you're backing up into a tight space. Maybe you're pulling into your uh, parking spot at the storage lot. You want to make sure that you can accommodate for that. Or if you don't have a ladder on the back of yours like we do with ours today, you could flip it up. Now, if you did want to have your ladder along with this, I'd probably go with the smaller size, maybe go down to that 24 by 60. That way you can kind of have this slid more down and then fold it up, get it out of the way and clear up some extra space. Right here we have our mounting bracket to our bumper that just slips on and then there's going to be a bolt on each side that's going to go across and slip into the other side of the bracket and uh, have a nut to tighten that down. From there, we're gonna have our support brace and that's gonna shoot across and actually support our cargo basket. If you look right here, we have a pin and clip that slips into place. Now, if we didn't have that ladder in the way, I would pop this out. We could flip our whole cargo carrier up and on the top of our bracket here on our bumper, it's got another little latch where you can stick that pin right through and hold your cargo carrier up. From the base of our basket up to the top, it's gonna to be right at three inches, so you've got plenty of room to kind of hold stuff up along this. There's a ton of tie down points on this, and like I said before, this is super sturdy. So putting your ratchet straps on there is gonna be real easy. You don't have to worry about it kind of crunching in and breaking any of the bars on here, like you might with some of the other flimsy cargo carriers out there on the market. Uh, one other thing with that, this cargo basket is rated for 500 pounds, but you are still limited to the weight capacity of your RV's bumper. So you're going to want to make sure that you reach out to your manufacturer and find out what the actual rate capacity is on that bumper. Overall, I really like how sturdy this cargo carrier is. You really don't have to worry about tearing it up like you might with some other ones. You can really put a whole lot in here. Um, personally, I'd probably go with the smaller one on this specific camper just because I'd like to be able to fold it up, kind of clear up some of that room too and keep it out of the way. Uh, one other thing you might want to do is maybe get a license plate attachment so that way you don't have to worry about blocking your license plate when you're out on the road. Well, I think that about does it for today's look at the 24 by 84 e-trailer cargo carrier for RV bumpers here on our 2022 East to West Alta travel trailer. My name's Kevin. Thanks for watching.